What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. Today I wanted to make a video, uh, kind of a personal video for you guys. I, I normally don't get into my personal situations and talk to you guys about my life, but I'm a regular person just like you guys. And, and like most of you, I go through the goods and bads and, and people in my family do as well. I'm actually dealing with a, a really tumultuous situation uh, in Ohio right now. My, my stepdad actually passed away on uh, the 15th. 15th of January, and um, he he was a great person, let me just say that, his name was Terry Wright, and uh, he was a beautiful spirit, beautiful person, uh, loved my mother and loved all her children, and uh, they were together for 16 years, they were married for four, and uh, he passed away on the 15th, now they got married on my mom's birthday, uh, four years ago, on January 19th, which just passed two days ago, so that was also a really, really rough birthday for my mother. Um, just one of those, he couldn't get worse type of situations has been for my mom for the last week. Um, but anyway, uh, we've got a funeral thing to, uh, take care of now. Funerals tomorrow on the 22nd. And, uh, we're taking care of that. Families being together, coming together as, as much as we can, uh, to support my mother. Um, now let me tell you guys a little bit about Terry. Terry grew up in Akron, Ohio, land of the snow. And, uh, he was mostly a factory worker worker for most of his life. He worked in factories. And actually, he met my mom uh, at a place called J.R. Wheels. And uh, they're both, they were opposites. He's a long-haired white guy. My mom's like a five-foot-tall little black Indian woman. And uh, they met and they dated and they ended up loving each other. And that's how life is. And um, they got together 16 years ago. And uh, about four years ago, Spoon was diagnosed. Well, his name is Terry, but his nickname is Spoon, as in cereal spoon was diagnosed with cancer um colon cancer and uh he's been fighting it for the last few years and at the sicker he got he was unable to work so for the last number of years my mother's been the sole source of income for the household taking care of his medical expenses also taking care of my my younger sister who had some issues during her birth and it cost it, it caused her to need constant care for her entire life so my mom the sole source of income for the both of them and she's been doing a phenomenal job but you know like like many times in life bad things happen and uh terry spoon man lost his battle to cancer on january 15th four days before his wife's birthday and his anniversary and it's a terrible terrible thing and so now we're at the final stages of trying to get this stuff taken care of and, and it's been really hard on my mom and so Kate and I started a GoFundMe page, a page where people who may have more or, or may have a dollar or two to spare can click on a link, read the person's story, read about the person who may have an issue or may have a need and donate if you want to. And so we started one for Terry Wright, my mom's husband, my stepfather. And I'm asking you guys, if you have it, to at least check it out. And if you don't have it, that's totally fine. If you don't have anything to spare and you're taking care of your own life and your own situations, I understand that totally. But I'm, I'm going to ask you a favor. If you can't do anything as far as donating to help with the final expenses of this man's life, please share the link. Share it on Facebook. That's probably the best place to start. Share it on everybody's page you know. Uh, this guy was a great person. Uh, I've known him for a very long time. And uh, it's really a sad situation to see someone you know is a good person walk out of here and, you, and then you see how it affects your loved ones you know my mother is really really tore up about this uh, my younger brother has been watching her very closely because uh, you know she's been really fluctuating in and out of the mind state that that I guess a person normally functions in you know she's been really really struggling and fighting uh, through this hard time and so it's funerals tomorrow here in Akron Ohio and uh I wanted to let you guys know about the GoFundMe page. And if you guys want to know more about Terry Wright, please click on the link below uh, and, and read about him and, and read about my mother and, and my little sister, Joselle, and the things that have been going on up there. And, and if you guys do have it, please donate. And anything will help. It doesn't have to be a particular amount. Just whatever you feel like you can spare would really help. And, and the finalization of this man's life and, and making sure that he's taken care of properly. And I really want to say thank you to everybody, even for watching this video, for sharing this video. Don't even worry about sharing the video. Just go to the link below, click on that link, copy and paste that link, and put it in everybody's Facebook page that you can. 
this needs to be known. This is a great person, and uh, we're all going to do our part to make sure that uh, he's taken care of and that, that my mom is able to continue to function uh, in, in this world. So thank you all. Now, I want to real quickly tell you guys about the footage that you're watching. This is actually a PC game uh, called Blade and Soul, which uh, is a game I've known about for quite a number of years. Uh, I remember when it first came out in Korea. That's where it originated. About four or five years ago, I watched the, the footage of it. And I was like, holy crap, this is a game that looks incredible. I want to try it. But it took this long for the game to actually come to the States. It's rel relatively new uh, to PC gamers now. So if you want to try this game, download it. It's absolutely free. It's one of those massively multiplayer online RPGs. So, and it, it's fun. It actually is fun. Uh, the characters are fully voiced. The, the characters look incredible. It's like an anime come to life. I love it. I love watching the, the character designs, the way that they put all this work into it. The world is beautiful and stunning. And uh, I didn't think I'd be able to play the game on high settings on my laptop, but I'm actually able to play it up here. So I'm pretty excited about that. If you guys like the gameplay, if you guys like the message, if you guys like Terry Wright, my stepfather, give a thumbs up and show support for this channel. Please, please, guys. Uh, share that link anywhere you can, Twitter, Facebook, let's get it shared across the country, and hopefully we can make a, a dent in this situation for my family. Thank you all so much for watching the video. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, and have a good weekend. I will definitely be back home in time for the Beastly Thought Show. I'm going to be leaving tomorrow night, so I'll be back home on Saturday. Thank you all. I appreciate all the love and support. I'm the Beastly Gamer. And I'll see you guys next time.